Uh, hey guys, this is just um, a quick example, really, uh, for Softfire on the Silver Magic's forums. Um, for some reason, whenever he tries to run the program I made, it, it's either giving him a syntax error or um, an unexpected indent, so um, I don't know what that is. I, the only thing I can think is that it's because he's using Python 3.0, but uh, this should still work. Um, as you can see, he's highlighted it, uh, where the syntax error is showing, and it's showing on that closing quotation, but I don't know why. Maybe uh, putting a space between the uh, string format and the closing quote might work. But uh, anyway, I'm just going to show the, uh, the program actually working. Uh, here's the source code. It's, it's exactly the same as what I've put up uh, up here. And if I just go and find the file again, uh, there we go. Find it up high. You can see everything works. I don't get any errors. Um, if I want to search for, um, I'll search for a. Um, I'll search in my tutorials folder. I want to know if I have a tutorial called um, PHP underscore. Actually, I don't have to. I can just put it in PHP, and then it will retrieve all the files which have the the value PHP in the name. So we can see here we've oh we've got several uh, in the um, in these in the fo folder ESIB tutorials. We can see PHP underscore one, PHP underscore one underscore part two, and then the sound files and then the video files and all that stuff. And now it actually gives us the option to open one of these files. If I press yes I want to open one of these files. Now it will loop through this whole list of files um, and we can say uh, no we don't want to open this file or yes we do want to open this file. Um, at our heart's content basically. So I don't want to open PHP underscore one video. No, I don't want to open that one. Don't want to open that one. Don't want to open that one. I think I'm gonna go ahead and try opening PHP underscore four. So I'll just keep pressing no until I see the video file that is by the way. Okay, we reach PHP underscore four and if I press yes, it's actually gonna use the um OS dot uh, run I think it is or something like that in the OS module and that will open this file but it do we don't it doesn't actually specify what program to use so it just uses the default program in Windows so if I press yes we can see now we can see it's uh, opened and run that with the default video player which is Windows Media Player and it will keep looping through whether we want to uh, look at stuff and once it gets the last one it says okay let's try the next one oh it says okay let's try the next one for each thing and uh, on the last one it says okay let's try the next one because that's just by default and then below it says oh looks like that was the last one and if we press enter the program finishes okay so uh, that was just to demonstrate uh, the functions in the uh, the finder.py file um, I think I'll probably put the source code up on uh, paste bin and if it works for you can re you reply um, and if it doesn't work can you reply and say um, it didn't work and can you give me the uh, the error message you got when you tried to run it anyway thanks guys for watching uh, I'll talk to you guys or sorry see you guys in the next tutorial I guess over now